Everywhere I turn, people are talking about March Madness and the Big Dance. Some kind of college basketball tournament, I think. But I want to talk more about March Madness township style. Welcome to Dave Talk. After a relatively mild winter, March came in like a lion. With spring just around the corner, let's hope it'll go out like a lamb and lead us to a snow-free April conference. Talk about madness. Can you believe the annual conference is about 30 days away? Isn't that crazy? It seems like we just left Hershey, but I have to tell you that staff has been working hard to bring you nearly 100 workshops, almost 300 exhibitors, some great speakers, as well as networking opportunities with fellow township officials and Harrisburg leadership at our legislative grassroots reception. There's still time to register, sign up to be a conference ambassador, or register your township for the Parade of Flags. You can also download the mobile app to start planning your personal schedule by checking out workshop schedules and the rest of the calendar of events. And while we're talking about madness and crazy things, check this out. We all know there are lots of unfunded mandates and outdated laws that are in need of updating, from prevailing wage to supervisor's compensation, but how many think of legal advertising as being outdated? Well, actually, who doesn't? You all know how you have to advertise meetings in the legal notices section in the printed edition of a newspaper of general circulation. With print newspapers disappearing, being bought out by out-of-town conglomerates, or simply published fewer and fewer days per week, declining readership was bound to follow. But that almost impossible to follow unfunded mandate is still in the law. We've been talking to legislators and legislative leaders about updating the legal advertising laws for the real world of today. Talk about the big dance. We will keep you posted and let you know when would be the best time to contact your House and Senate members. It's a delicate balance because we also have to keep in mind that one of the players at the table is the news media. And speaking of the news media, it's March, and we're in the midst of Sunshine Week. It's a week when news organizations across the country highlight the importance of transparency in our government. Our residents deserve to see meeting records or other already created documents, and local government is committed to transparency more than most. PSATS is co-sponsoring a Sunshine Week education program with the Office of Open Records and the news media. The newspaper associations asked if we would use our electronic communication networks to boost attendance. More madness. <laughs> Maybe they should buy an ad in the meeting notices section. You know, as I reflect on the madness at the township level, it seems almost all of it comes from Harrisburg and Washington level rules, mandates, and outdated laws. I hope to see you at the annual PSATS conference in Hershey, where we gather to reverse that trend. Well, that's all the time I have. Join us next week for Coffee in the Capitol, and remember to check the YouTube video description for links to register for the 2024 conference, and to follow PSETS on Facebook. Thanks for tuning in.